Hi, today Mako and I are getting ready to go to the beach. We're gonna share our favorite three beaches in sunny South Florida with you so that you may enjoy with your dog as well. Get your Frisbee Mako, let's get ready to go. Don't forget your sunglasses. Here we go. This is Jody Goodell, your pet lover's realtor, coming to you from beautiful, sunny South Florida. Now Mako has his Frisbee and we're ready to go to the beach. I have plenty of fresh water for both of us, a bowl, sunscreen, I'm wearing my sun shirt. <laughs> Mako has a sun shirt too, although it's very hard to get him into it. I will do my best today to get him into it before we leave the house. So our number one place to go is Bark Beach in Boca Raton, Florida. Bark Beach is located in Spanish River Park and allows dogs with permits to come on the weekends. On Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, you can enjoy your time at the beach from 7 to 9 a.m. and then also from 3 p.m. until sunset in daylight savings time and 5 p.m. until sunset in Eastern Standard Time. It's located between lifeguard towers number 18 and 20, and you must have a permit to get in, which you can get as a resident of Boca Raton for all of $31. As a non-resident, it costs a little bit more. It's $167. It's still very well worth it. And if you decide at the last minute you just want to go to the beach with your dog during those hours, you may buy a day pass at the guard gate to Spanish River Park for $11. So some of the rules are you must have your pet leashed upon entering the beach and leaving the beach. And of course, with any beach that you take your dog to, you must clean up any type of dog waste products. Please don't leave your pet waste on the beach carry disposable pet bags with you and dispose of them in the proper receptacles. This is a lot of fun. The dogs can splash and play around with each other and with you. You can play Frisbee, which is Mako's favorite thing. The permits are good yearly from October 1st through September 31st, and you must carry them with you to the beach and have them on your persona at all times. Our second favorite beach is called Canine Beach in Fort Lauderdale. There's 100 yards dedicated to our canine friends at Canine Beach in Fort Lauderdale, and it's located in U. Taylor Birch State Park. It's open November through March from 3 p.m. until 7 p.m., and April through October from 3 until 9 p.m. Make sure you bring your Frisbee. To get annual permits, you must provide vaccination info for your dog, as well as proof of residency for the city of Fort Lauderdale. Please clean up after your pet, and keep your dogs leashed at all times. The third spot we'd like to go to is Hollywood Dog Beach. open on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from 3 to 7 p.m. And in daylight savings time, they're open from 4 p.m. until 8 p.m. You must show proof of vaccination. Make sure that your dog is under control and with you at all times. And as always, pick up the waste products. The price of a six-month pass is $30 per dog for a resident, $60 per dog for a non-resident. You may also purchase a daily pass for $5 for a resident and $10 for a non-resident per dog. Make sure you clean up after your pet and your pet is with you and under control at all times. And always carry this permit with you. Mako and I also like to play ball. 
This is Jody Goodell, your pet lover's realtor, coming to you from sunny Boca Raton, Florida. If you have any questions about the beach or would like further information, please watch my next video. And subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a wonderful day and I will see you next week.